State leaders voicing their concerns when it comes to Lubbock joining ERCOT this summer. State Representative Dustin Burroughs addressing the issue in a teleconference town hall with voters. KLBK's Alyssa Tay is joining us now. And you spoke to Mayor Pope about the issue today. Did he voice any concerns? Yeah, Terry, as we reported, these concerns come after ERCOT faced widespread outages during February's winter storm. More than 4 million homes and businesses were left without power. Lubbock is scheduled to join ERCOT later this year. This as the Texas legislature has been hearing testimony and bills to figure out a solution. Lubbock is only months away from joining the ERCOT grid, but state and local leaders say they do have their share of concerns after February's snowstorm. We expect ERCOT to be safe and to provide choice, uh, and we also expect it to be reliable, and it, it, it failed its last test on reliability. Mayor Pope says they continue to watch the situation closely and have been looking at their options, having conversation with the governor, lieutenant governor, as well as the legislature. The most important item in front of them maybe save the budget. In a teleconference call, State Representative Dustin Burrow saying, quote, for those of us who are not in the ERCOT grid, hopefully there can be a bit of a pause before we join to make sure those things aren't passed on to people who can't afford it. State Senator Charles Perry telling the Texas Tribune, quote, if there's a way to pause, take a deep breath and survey, that would be my recommendation. We've gone down that path. We don't know that there's an option there, but he certainly, uh, um, uh, certainly is a uh, uh, very much entitled to those thoughts. Lubbock Power and Light began the process to join ERCOT in September of 2015, and about 70% of the electrical grid will be transferred to the ERCOT market in June. What is the likelihood, in your opinion, that we join the ERCOT grid on June 1st? I think it's pretty high. I mean, that's the... That's what we've been working for. Mayor Pope also says he's cautiously optimistic about joining the grid, remembering this conversation with Governor Abbott. Compared where we are today with ERCOT to a, to a used car, and he said, your timing is going to be good, Mayor, because when Lubbock gets in, we're going to have a, a shiny new car. We're going to have things fixed. Councilman Jeff Griffith also telling the Texas Tribune the LPNL board could come to city council with a recommendation to pause. Mayor Pope says he hasn't heard any discussions on the matter at this time.